my whole goal is to make an inexpensive uh, vehicle that the masses can use and that uh, people in Asia and all over the world can afford. I've always been concerned about automotive safety from the time I was in college. I roughly estimated I've got a billion airbags in uh, the spirit for you. When I made a little model out of cardboard foam and uh, little toy motorcycles, I uh, came up with the idea of uh, rather than trying to put airbags in, I could use the billion airbags in foam. We spent six months trying to develop our uh, molding process where we uh, put in our fiberglass core board and uh, then dump in about 60 pounds of foam and voila, you pop out uh, the foam car. We've got over six inches of foam on the sides, a uh, couple foot crash zones of foam on the front and the rear. And that's both to protect the occupants and also it protects pedestrians and motorcycles, bicyclists, which in the world over half the people killed are not inside the vehicle, they're outside the vehicle. And also another element of the design of it is uh, we've got sort of wedge shape, so if you do hit somebody, most likely they're going to be glanced off rather than, you know, direct impact. We even floated it in the water, so you also protect people from uh, floodwaters. <laughs> and uh, so it, uh, the first time I drove it, it uh, did very good. I was only going to go about 30 miles an hour and felt so safe I went ahead and went 60 miles an hour uh, on the first test run. I see this as a world car. It's not just developed for any, any country. I want to uh, license people in different uh, countries to produce it and use local materials. You know, they can use, again, like Italy, they can use a engine produced in Italy and China, they can use an engine produced in China so that uh, we can quickly ramp up production. Uh, I'd like to make over a million vehicles a year in five years. In the Progressive X Prize, uh, there's a lot of design evaluations by uh, experts in the automotive industry to uh, say, you know, how safe is your vehicle? And we've passed those. It's like an FDA approval of vehicles that then, you know, go forward with production and uh, get credibility among suppliers. We may not win, but uh, we just want the publicity to be able to meet the requirements and you know, at least get 100 miles per gallon and prove that our vehicle is uh, ready for production.